Not a starry fire and destroy them. You're gonna burn the ring. Okay. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome to another Poppy Gabriel horror game. This one's called Welcome to Home Ownership. After signing the paperwork, you became the proud owner of 87 Harper Road, along with its dark secrets and ghostly occupants. Uncover more information about the haunting of 87 Harper Road and why. Sophia's spirit won't carry on to the other side. So we're gonna smack her to go to the other side. But before we do, make sure you like, subscribe, and sh uh, share, and hit that little bell. That way you know my videos go live for you. You can check out all my videos at youtube.com slash poppygraybeard. You can also check me out on TikTok at tiktok.com slash poppygraybeard. Or you can watch me live on Twitch at twitch.tv slash poppygraybeard. All right, we're gonna smack that ass. I didn't mean to say that. I didn't mean to say that. Okay, all right, <clears throat> here we go. This game model stays at the beginning of each night. Controls can be found by pressing escape. Night one. All right, whoo. Finally got everything inside the house. Hard to believe this place is actually mine. I'll be stuck with this mortgage for years, but it's more roomy than that cramped studio and the price wasn't too bad. I should probably order something to eat. I didn't realize that the day was nearly over already. <clears throat> the phone service should be working, so I'll test out the landline. Use the phone to order food. I'm excited. I mean, look at this. Look at the look at the way we set up this furniture. You know what I'm saying? There's a few boxes there, right? But there's nothing in front. Like, what are we gonna? Oh, there's a TV up there. Okay, my bad. My bad. I'm judging. I'm judging. Okay. Nice house. Okay. Let's find the phone. Can we run? Nope, can't run. <clears throat> we have our own dishwasher separate. See, our dishwasher is like under the desk. But it's nice. You know? Gotta clean that stove a little bit. It is what it is. Oh, I can turn off the lights and turn it back on. Okay. So the, the phone is probably upstairs. So let's go. But I saw a shadow, but... Well, oh, no, the phone's right there, stupid. Stupid. All right, here we go. Thanks for calling Tony's Pizza. Pick up or delivery. DiGiorno, baby. <clears throat> delivery, please, to 87 Harper Road. Sure. What you want? Pizza. Can I have a large pizza with pepperoni? Simple. You got it. Should be delivered in about 25 minutes. All right. Well, that gives me plenty of time to get those boxes into the right room then. Move the boxes into the right rooms. All right. Here we go. Pick the bedroom box. La -da -da. I'm guessing bedrooms are upstairs. They gotta be, right? Oh, not bad. This is a big house. Okay, where's the rooms? Here we go. It's the bedroom? Nope, bathroom. <coughs> Four rooms up here, okay. I thought I saw. Scare me like that, okay. I need a. Oh, this is a spare room. My bad, my bad. Don't judge me. Okay, so I'm guessing master bedroom. Ha! Gotta trick me. There we go. Big old box. Okay. Okay. Keep my eyes open because you never know. I feel like I'm mentioning in this house. Is it me? I feel like I'm, am I little? I love little peoples. I get the little peoples. That's how I feel. I love the little peoples. Okay, picked up the closet box. Cool. Let's do it. That's the bathroom. That's the closet box right there. All right. Let's do it. Put it right there. All right. Anything unusual in here? No? Beautiful. Beautiful. Look outside. Beautiful. Nice neighborhood. Everybody's house looks the same. Everybody's chilling. You know, I like it. I like it. You notice how much power like gets drained <clears throat> daily from people that are just leaving lights on? Can you imagine how much shit we will save if we could just turn off the lights? Bathroom box, right? Bathroom box. I'm just saying, look, we have every light on in this house and it's like, it's just me. You know, if that sensors, 
If people have sensors, that will work. All right, put that there. Like, like if there were sensors that you walk in and out, just they turn it off. That'd be nice. Get a lot of power, and they make them. What is that? I need a living room box. I need a living room box. Okay, I don't know. Where does this go? I didn't even read it. You know why I didn't read it? Because I'm stupid. It's probably one of these bedrooms. This one, right? Spare room. There it is. All right, cool. Look at me. Getting all tidy and stuff. Moving is sucks. Is that me? Moving is a, a tough thing to do. Wait for my pizza. I was thinking forever. Okay. I need the living room box. I need the living room box. Okay. Is there another box over here that I didn't see? Oh, here you go. Picked up kitchen box. It's so dark. I didn't even know that was there. All right. Okay. This is the kitchen, right? There we go. Big box. I'm telling you, I have little people. I'm little. I, I, I've already, you know. Dining room box. Right there. Just could have just left the where I was at. And living room box. Hey! What's up, bro? Who is it? What's up, bro? We're gonna make love later on. Should I put the little lock on? <clears throat> oh, it's a pizza. Best in town delivery pizza. Delivery. That'll be. Huh? So you're the new homeowner? Yeah. Yeah. You want to make out? Sorry, I didn't mean to be invasive. But after what happened here, I'm surprised the house moved so quickly. Interesting. What happened? My real estate agent said there was a couple living here before that had a falling out and wanted to sell it fast. Hmm. Pizza's going to get cold, but you know, I'm going to ask some questions. Uh, falling out is a nice way of putting it. Personally, though, it was a really messy engagement that ended pretty badly. Rumors say the bride to be got. Rumors say the bride to be got cold feet and attacked the groom. I don't want to speak ill of the dead, but there's some things that aren't always seen in the public by the public. I'm sure you'll clean this place up nicely. I see you already got the living room looking better than than they had. It. Um, thanks. How much do I owe you for the pizza? You know what? First pizza's on me. Consider it a welcome to the neighborhood. You're fired, bro. Thanks for that, I guess. Bye. Hey, that was weird. Free pizza. Uh, I'll just eat it on the couch. Not like anyone can tell me otherwise. Okay, put the pizza. He left. I can't even go outside. Okay, cool. Damn. That close kind of hard. <clears throat> Make sure he's not watching me eat this pizza, you know? All right. Mmm, it's crunchy. Jeez, must have been hungrier than I thought I was. I finished the whole thing myself. It is a woman, right? Is it a woman? I don't remember. I ain't judging. There's no judgment here. I'm sure I'll regret that in the morning. Big poops. Big poops. But I should throw this out and get ready to sleep. Throw out the empty box. Okay, here we go. La -da -dee -da -da -da. What's going on here? That wasn't cool. I don't appreciate that. Maybe the wind slammed it. I see. I see movement over there. Is it me? By the trees. Okay. 
All right. Well, that's enough weirdness for one day. I'll turn off the lights and get some sleep. Turn off the lights and, and go to sleep. Can't close this window? All right. Okay, drop that light. I conserve power, baby. You gotta leave that one window open with no screen. You know what I'm saying? Can't like that door? No problem. There we go. Drop that light. It's getting dark in here. So take off all your clothes. All right, we're going upstairs. It's almost night night time. I think it's a switch. Yep. No. How do I, <clears throat> how do I turn up the light down there? All right there. Oh. Can't even find the stairs to go upstairs. You know what I'm saying? Jesus. Going all out. What the hell? Moonlight. God, that freaks me out, that stupid thing. All right. Oh, bathroom light. But, no, you can that on at first. Got a nice shower. A lot of lights to flicker on and off. Okay. Every light's on, you know. Everything's off? Okay. Except for this one. See, but it's like, you know when you're a kid, how you turn off a light, and then it gets dark, and you have to run through the darkness? That's how I feel right now. I'm scared. Oh. Got the goosebumps for real. All right. The door. Oh my god, every window shows like it looks like there's some creepy. Okay. Night night. Night two. Finally done with work. And able to relax in my new home. Look at the kitty. Look at the kitty over there. No, that's a real kitty or not. I reek of shoppers in poor life choices and desperation thought. I should take a shower before I do anything else. Now we're talking. Go take a shower. But is that a kitty? That's what I needed. That's the question I got. Okay, got a little book there. There's a kitty cat. Or is this just a statue? It's a statue. Okay, fair enough. All right. Let's go take a shower. Cause I stinky from working all day. All right. Get my toothbrush out and stuff. Okay. Hell yeah. So fresh and so clean, clean. Investigate the knock. Okay. What else knocking at my door right now? Hmm. Hey, hmm. <coughs> we need a light up here, like in this corner. That's not enough. <coughs> All right. Hmm, I must have visitors. Nobody. Oh, this box is outside. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? You know, I nailed it. <clears throat> wow, really? Yeah, I did nail it. Even in this quiet neighborhood, there's still kids playing Ding Dong Ditch. What's that sound? When the night has come and the lights are off, I am scared. I'm going to die and we'll see. That's a, that's a song. Tell me that's not a song. Okay, here we go. Oh, 
was that? That was kind of. Sh- that window's closed, which is nice. <gasps> we got fruit. <clears throat> we got coffee. Look at us. Got microwave. We got some wood logs, some wood log cereal. Part of this complete breakfast. All right. I don't know what happened there, but is it already nighttime already? Hmm. Three little birds. I'm awful of <clears throat> harmony today. Let's take another shower. Is it bedtime already? Oh my god, that shadow back there is creepy. What do we do? <clears throat> the lights are flickering. Right? I can't run. So even if there was a monster in here, which is probably mostly a ghost, what do I do? Is it night night time? Investigate the knock. I did. Remember? Why is it so dark over here? No, don't do that. Hmm. Oh, I, I'm just sleep deprived. This move has taken a lot out of me and, and coffee. A nice cup of, a nice hot cup of coffee will set my nerves straight. Go make coffee, stupid. All right, let's go make some coffee. The best part of waking up. I mean, work was a pain, but not enough to start seeing things. Like lights flickering. That's not seeing things. That shit happening. It's going down. Maybe it's the stress of moving in. I only moved across town, but I still feel like a bit of a stranger here. Unless that pizza guy can be right, can he? I gotta look this up. Glad I set my computer up in the spare room. Ooh! Hot breath. It was hot. You know, sometimes when they put the hot breath on you, it's not pleasant. Makes you feel very uncomfortable. Look at the spare room, right? Oh, look at that. Game PC and stuff. Okay. There we go. All right. Just a few clicks, a few clicks, and typing. Ignore the ads and what is clearly not a whole hot single in my area. Damn. No single people? There. A news report talking about 87 Harper Road. Oh, look at that. Bright to be. Found dead. This is a Troy Times Daily. Your news the day after it happens. Makes sense. Makes sense. All right. On the morning of September 1st, Sophia Lancier was found unresponsive with her home at 87 Harper Road by her fiancé, Jason Barnes. Despite paramedics' best attempts, she was unable to be revived and was pronounced dead on the scene. Sophia and Jason were due to be wed on September 28th. And in lieu of gifts, don't judge me, for the marriage, Jason has asked that all pros- prospective gifts be donated to the local woman's shelter that Sophia worked at. No wrongdoing has ever insinuated by the local police force, and we are continuing to try to find any further information on the death of Sophia Lancier. Yes, I say it. And at the bottom, it says, Recently it's been brought to our attention that some children have been watching so-called Let's Play on their computers and mobile devices. While we have no actual information on the impact this may have on, on, the, ch- on the child's development, we're upset with the fact that print media is dying. Oh, newspaper. 
Okay. Oh my God. I can't believe I didn't look up this up before I bought the house. Cause you're stupid. But ghosts aren't real. It's just gotta be bad vibes or something. I'm sure that a good night's rest, maybe even a jog in the morning, and my mind will be at ease. Go to bed. This bed? No. The other bed. I'm gonna leave all the lights on, okay? Nobody cares. As, it better not tell me to turn off all the lights because that's gonna creep me out. Go to bed. All right, cool. Night three! I could barely focus at work. I gotta look up more on this death. I don't see any noticeable stains. And this carpet isn't fresh. Is that my stomach? Damn it. Damn it. Is that how it's been spelled this whole time, all my life? Because I could have sworn that it was two M's. But hey, you know, uh, I didn't even eat lunch today. I got to just warm something up. Okay. Get something to eat from the fridge. My hungry ass. Hungry ass. One look at you and I see your hungry ass. All right, here we go. This works. What do I got? Now to microwave it up. What is it? What is it? Frozen veggies? That's what I'm going to eat? Wow. I'd rather have some freaking wood logs, but hey. You know, you're trying to eat healthy, right? All right, just watch my back because you never know. Oh, wow. Because the microwave is running, we lose power. It's cool. Keep it together. Keep it together. What the hell? I seriously blew a circuit? It should just blow that, not the whole house. Glad my phone's charged to use as a flashlight. Wow, nice phone. Wood logs. Woos! All right, so where am I supposed to go to? I never saw. Do I have to go outside? In that All right. I fell. I fell by itself. You saw that? Well, obviously, there's no damn nail. Was that all there? It was there. All right, where do I got to go outside? Okay. No? So where's the... Um... Damn, we got something so hard. So where's the circuit thing? Oh, my God, look. A golden hand. Okay, so that fell. I gotta find the circuit thing on the wall. Oh look, there's still light. See, see it? Still on. Pretty interesting. Okay, let's go upstairs. It's gotta be upstairs somewhere. Right? There was a window there that whole time. Is it in the bathroom? What would that be? Spare bedroom? No. Is it in my room? Oh, it's in that closet. Dummy. Today I'm not stupid. I'm a dummy. It's right there. Okay. All right. Well, let's see. I got refresh. A few other products. Are those donuts? Carnival crazy. Okay. Looks like. Three fuses blew. At least I have some spares around here. Grab the fuses. Okay. okay. What did I grab? Is that, is that what I grabbed? Okay. Oh, here's another one right there. The other one was hidden. Is it me? All right. I just saw him trying to grab it. There it goes. Damn, that's all that's in here. There may be another fuse in the kitchen drawer. Find the last fuse. That was weird because there was a fuse right there. I didn't even see it. Oh. I think 
Give me a comfortable. Oh, I'm gonna go so hard. Slamming doors. Not a fan. Okay. Okay. I could live in this house. I love it. I could live in this house. Ah! Now pop these in and get the lights back on. You saw those fuses? They're like car fuses, right? Because the house fuse is like this big old thing. It's like a... It's like a little... Oh, man! Okay. All right. It took my breath away. Have you ever had your breath, breath taken away? Because it did. I was just like... I should have ran upstairs to see where she went. Oh my god, I'm now I'm seeing things. God, I lost track of where the fuse box is at. Okay, it's in the closet. I'm gonna lock myself in here. Got goosebumps in me. Okay, 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 calm down. Whew. Okay, the lights are on. Oh, you're so slow. And so fast. No, 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 no. I can say, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that song? You guys know that song. All right. I'm out of here. I need to call the pizza delivery guy. He has to know something about what's happening. All right, I'm going to call the pizza guy. But that girl was right there. Where'd she go? She was crawling. Yeah, I lost my voice. <clears throat> See, my voice is, is going. And she was right there. She was just chilling. Okay. Other pizza guy. Thanks for calling Tony's Pizza. Probably the only one that works there, but you know. Our hours are 1 p.m. to 11 p.m., so please call again during business. Wow. That sucks. Are you kidding me? I'm going to call as soon as I'm out of work tomorrow. For now, I guess I'll I'll just sleep with the lights on. I mean, it's day three, you know. I haven't even been here a week yet. Can I turn my phone? Okay. Time to go night night. Can I close the door. Super loud. Super loud. All right. Date night four. I was going to say day, but I messed up. All right, no more screwing around. I'm calling the pizza shop and getting some answers. I need a kitty. I need a pet. Tony's Pizza, pick up a delivery. Uh, delivery. 87 Harper Road. And can you send the same guy as before? Yeah, sure. What do you want? Lush pepperoni. Oh. Anything. Delivery, a bag of chips or whatever. I just need to talk to the delivery guy. Yeah, yeah. You'll get it soon then. Wow, oh, add it to it. That was fast. Answer the door. I don't see nobody out there. All right, is it me? Ain't nobody out there. Huh. Please don't turn around. Just don't scare me. Please don't scare me. TV. All right. What the? Okay. All right. What am I doing? Can I leave? Go. 
Leave! I can't leave. She closed the door on me. She opened it again. What happened? This is like a jam. What do I do? Answer, answer the door. The door's open. Hey, uh, I'm not sure what kind of impression you got of me, but look, that's not what I need to talk to you about. All right, we're not here to make love. Not today. You said you knew about the previous owners of the house. What happened to them? I, I know them. Why? What's happening? The lady never left. She keeps messing with me. Never left? That's impossible. I found her on the floor completely lifeless after she... Wait, you found her? Yes, this used to be our... My house. Wow, that's the guy. We were supposed to get married, but she was getting irate about everything regarding the wedding. One night she lost it, taking the rings and throwing them down the bathroom sink drain. I let her be figuring it was just wedding jitters dumps them out and he's just like eh, it's just the wedding jitters no big deal when I came home from work the next day she was gone dead and gone I couldn't get it out I know the song was there after the funeral I never set foot in this house again too many good and bad memories within these walls I, I'm sorry to hear that. But she's haunting this place, and I'm sure you'd want her spirit to be at rest. You're right. I didn't know much about ghosts. <sighs> but aren't they usually tied to something important to them? Maybe the rings. Ding. <laughs> That's a great idea. Thanks. Look, I need to finish my deliveries, but good luck. I hope you can give Sophia some peace if what you're saying is real. Wow, you're going to leave me again? You're going to leave me again? You're going to leave me again? I still can see it behind the wall. Stupid. So now what? What do I do? I don't have a flashlight. So I go in the sink? You think those rings are still in there? Interesting. Let's see. Nope. Maybe the bathroom sink? It's dark. I turn the lights? Nope. Don't do that. Where's the other light? There they are. Woo! Okay. Okay. She's off. What's the objective? Get the rings. All right. So where are they? In the sink? Oh, look, the paint's back up. Cool. Thank you, ghost. Maybe the bathroom. Oh my god. What up, what up. Ugh, there's so much hair in there. I would be a lot of hair in there. I mean, I guess. Oh, gurgly. There we go. Nice looking rings. If it wasn't tied to a ghost, I think about pawning them. Don't get a lot, but it's cool. Now to start a fire and destroy them. You're gonna burn the rings. Okay. <laughs> oh! I don't appreciate that. I don't. But I'm gonna burn your shit now. I'm gonna burn them. 
Because where am I going to start a fire? Do I go outside? Or do I do it in here in a pot? Oh, here we go. No. Microwave them? No. Put in the coffee machine? No. Can I go in the backyard now? I could probably go outside. Oh, right here. Fireplace. Fireplace. All right. Oh. Oh, I'm, I'm cornered. Is it, is it over? Objective, question mark. What do I do? Look at that. Chestnuts burning on an open fire. Could I go night night? Could I leave? Nope. Oh, I guess so. Oh, they're crackling now. All right, I'm gonna go to bed. I'm good. Sweet. All right. La la. La 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 la. La la. Well, before we go to bed, okay, it's been a long day, you know. You know? Long day. Oh, there's a little left. It's just before we go to bed. Now we're going to bed. Hell yeah. I hear voices. I still hear the fire like it's next to my head. Why is that? Let's go to bed. Day five. I actually got a good nice rest. I was starting to think I'll never sleep peaceful, peacefully here. Peacefully. I have an actual weekend to enjoy this place. Relax with some breakfast. All right. Let's do that. <laughs> oh! God. I'm okay now. I'm okay. That's crazy. Damn it. I thought it was over. Maybe Jason uh, has some other idea that might be keeping her here. Call Jason. Ah, she wants to give me a heart attack. I appreciate that. There's no dial tone. Did she really cut the line? Now what? What the hell is she doing up there? Investigate the banging. Where's the banging? Out here? It's foggy outside. Nope, it's not here. It's upstairs. What's going on? Girl. She the moonwalk on me, man. You saw that? All right, all right. No big deal. It's coming from that, coming from in here. <sighs> Ready? I thought it was coming from in there. So it sounds like, right? I hear it on my right side. Can I jump? Whee! Maybe she's in here. Oh, <gasps> that's where she's at. She's not. I open all the doors. Oh, 
There's a latch up there. Check out the cro really. I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to go up there. How am I supposed to know there was a cross space up there? There was. It was no lines. Wow, a secret cross space. Guess there's nothing better to do than go up. All right. Well, here we go. He's crying. I got a flash. I didn't even know. I got hot breath. Oh my God. It's like a maze. Are you okay? You want hugs and kisses? Cause I got some. Oh, I got some for you. Oh, she's crying. Oh, has she been trapped up here this whole time? But she was doing the moonwalk. How did she learn how to do that? Girl, where are you going? Trust me, he's gonna walk right to the wall. Okay. All right. You're gonna cry that whole time to get sympathy. Symphony? Sympathy from me, and then you're just gonna walk away. No. Not today. Oh, look at that beautiful dress. Look at you. That's what you want, the dress? Baby, please don't, please don't be there. Okay, so what do I do now? I'm in, I'm in the crawl space. Okay. Okay. All right, I saw the dress. Anywhere else to go? I go up, down, what am I missing? Put a wig on it, girl. I'm gonna ring on it. You better put a wig on it. Oh, I gotta do the book. There we go. <clears throat> Jason pro oh, so 4 4 2021. Jason proposed to me yesterday. And of course I said yes. When I told my mother about it, she suggested keeping a diary of every step of the way to recollect when we grow old together. I can't imagine writing it all down, but I'll be sure to keep the important moments in. 5 through 21. We met with a photographer today, and it all seemed to be great. It's a bit pricey, but Jason's dad said that they'll cover some of the cost. I don't even I don't want anything big or fancy, just a small ceremony in the park. 5, uh, 5, 5 16, 2021. The park was amazing. The gazebo overlooks the pond. The park management said they will let us borrow some lights in case the gathering goes late. And since it'll be in late September, the weather will hopefully be good. I can't wait now. 526. I went for my dress fitting today. I know it's a bit early, but I just wanted to make sure the design was perfect. I based it off of my grandmother's wedding gown, but added a bit of flair. To make it my own. 6-2. While we were tuxedo shopping, Jason got a call. His mother invited him, invited his aunts and uncles to the wedding. I was hoping it would just be 10 people max. But already the list has grown to 30. Damn. People got like 200 people, 500 people these days. I told Jason he needed to tell his mom not to invite anyone else. But he said since they're paying for it... Then we could invite whoever they wanted. Now we're talking. Oh my God, how long is this? I can't read all that. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try. Uh, six, so Jason invited his coworkers, bringing the new total to 43. We've been, we've been, we've, we haven't even gotten to talk to caterers and now I'm dreading how much it will cost to feed 43 people. What? Is he going to save us money by getting Tony's to cater? Uh, 613. I realized that 
that when I booked the park, I told them it would be 10 people. I called management to make sure it would be fine to have 43 people around the gazebo. But they said that policy is only to allow 20 people inside at once. We need to have some people inside and outside at all times. So I had to cancel the booking. You see where it's going? It went like, whew, and I was slowly like crashing down. 616. Mom told me she managed to book us a wing of Hampstead Manor, Manor for the wedding. That big, gaudy, posh-eyed store of an edge of town that the country club owns. She didn't even ask me if I wanted it. She just insisted that her and dad will cover the cost to rent it for six hours. I can see it happening. It's just slowly creeping in. 712. We had a tuxedo picked out, but Jason's dad said that they needed matching outfits. And Jason went without telling me to pick out new suits. We agreed on accent, 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 accenting, accenting it with a pink rose. But his dad talked him out of it, saying it would look sissy. 718. I'm so full. We spent all day taste testing with the caterers and decided together on chicken parmesan steak colettes, cuddles, and baked salmon on our entrees. The salmon was as flaky and juicy. I had to get seconds and thirds. That's how you say salmon, right? I could be wrong. All right. 722. Invites have been sent, giving everyone plenty of time to respond back with what they want to eat and making sure they'll be there. Jason had a call with his parents about the cost of everything so far, but he didn't say anything about how it went. They can't afford to pay more than even 10% of what it's costing us, and we don't have the money either. 7.30. We joked having Tony's Make the food for us. 813. I picked up my dress today. One of the few things that I was able to choose myself and I didn't have change or fall apart in front of me. It looks beautiful and still fits perfectly. 821. He wasn't joking about Tony's catering the wedding. He came home so excited to share it, uh, to share that it'll cost a fraction of the original caterer's price. But everything I've had from them has been all right at best. I don't want to talk stuff about his job, but I'll never be a buttery, it will never be as be as buttery smooth. Sounds interesting. 829, dad called and asked why Aunt Paula and Aunt Maureen never received an invitation. He gave me all kinds of crap for wanting a small wedding going on about how we're, they're paying for the place to fit everyone. Then demanded that I call them to get their family's food request. Oh, why am I yawning so much? 831. The only thing I was able to pick this entire time was this dress. Nothing else is mine. I can't anymore. That's when it goes down. Okay, so I'm supposed to read that book before I saw the dress? Okay. Where'd it go? I went the wrong way, okay. Whoa! Oh! Hey there. All right, I'm going to burn the dress. Let's go. Hey, all right. That's cool. Oh, it's a mannequin. Is that weird? Maybe it is. But I'm here to burn the dress. <clears throat> Fireplace. Oh my god, here we go. We can make it. We can make it. Did I get a door open? I'm sure I did. Burn it! Why can't I burn it? I'm gonna close the door first. 
Oof. Oh, there it is. Uh-oh. What's up, girl? Look at you. Shake it. Shake it, girl. Shake it. Oh, she's burning, too. Damn. So she went to rest in peace and burned on the way there. It's weird. It feels warmer and not just because of the fire. I think it's actually over now. Enjoy your house. Okay, how am I going to enjoy it? What's up, bro? Are we going, am I your new love? We're going to make love and stuff? What's up, bro? Man, you look... Mm, you know what I'm saying? Hey, I want to stop by and see how it went. It wasn't the rings she cared, she cared about. It was the dress. Her dress? Yeah, I found her journal, and it was the only wedding thing she was able to pick out. Jerk. I, I, I had no idea. All of this... All this was putting so much pressure on her. She probably didn't tell you. But I understand. I wish it didn't end this way, but I'm glad she's at peace now. Is that my next? Thank you so much for doing what I couldn't. I hope you'll be able to make better memories than I was able to hear. What are you doing? What are you doing, bro? Think you're Michael Jackson? You know what I'm saying? That's it. So that was Welcome to Home Ownership. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, share, subscribe, hit that little bell. That way you know my videos go live for you. You can check out all my videos at youtube.com slash poppygraybeard. You can also check me out on TikTok at tiktok.com slash poppygraybeard. Or you can watch me live on Twitch at twitch.tv slash poppygraybeard. Thank you so much for watching. Until the next one, peace, y'all.